And now it was time to find out why. Arnold? Without mincing words. What time are tryouts tomorrow? Same time as every day. Right. Okay, enough chit-chat. Let's cut to the chase. Why do I keep making the cuts? I think I know what you're getting at, Arnold. You've been making a lot of errors. You haven't been handling the bat the way you'd like. And you're wondering why I keep you around. I think you and I know the answer to that. His name? Oh, no. It's Charlie Hustle. Huh? You got a lot of desire, kid, a lot of heart. That's one of the first things I look for in a player. Really? You bet. You can keep your hot shots who think somebody owes them a starting position. Just give me one guy who loves the game. One guy who plays his heart out. One guy you can count on. One guy. Could that be me? Maybe I've been all wrong. Maybe I did have potential. Maybe making the cuts hadn't had anything at all to do with... You know your dad saved my life in Korea? Huh? Never told you, huh? <laughs> Doesn't surprise me. Yeah. Pulled me out of the line of fire once. There's nothing I wouldn't do for that man. Saved my life. Yeah, forget it. No. I owe you, Arnold. Anything, just name it. Well, you know, someday I may have a son. If you're ever in a position to put him on a baseball team, I'd really appreciate it. Consider it done. You know, in fact, it'd be nice if you were a starter. Well, you know, I can't promise anything. Look out! <sighs> starter it is. Yeah, and I'm sure he'd like to play somewhere in the infield. Well, I don't know. Look out, look out! Come on, let's get the hell out of here. It gave a whole new meaning to the concept of war, knowing that millions of brave men had gone off to fight and save lives just so their inept sons could play junior high school baseball. Hey, you know, I've been thinking. This mid of yours is getting kind of ratty. How'd you like to go out and get a new one? A new mitt? Yeah, why not? I don't need a new mitt. Hey, where do you get a whiff of that fresh new rawhide on your hand? What do you say? Though moments like this for my father were rare, it wasn't hard to see what he was feeling. Unfortunately, I also had an idea of why. There's no way I could break it in in time for tomorrow. Of course not. I just have a feeling you're going to need it after tomorrow. And there it was, the smoking gun, the dead giveaway. We'll go down to Kel Sporting Goods. They must have a ton in stock right now. Come on. It'll be fun, Kev. Let's go. Look, I don't want a new mitt. I can do fine with my own, okay? Let him get his own mitt. I was sick of playing someone else's game. As I stepped back up to the plate, all the cares, all the worries, all the burdens I'd carried around for the past few days just disappeared. All right, come on, Arnold. Give it a poke. Give it a ride. Suddenly, the outside world fell away. It was just me. And baseball. Come on, Kevin, give it a rip. Let's go. Come on, Kevin, give it a rip. My moment had arrived. And I knew what I had to do. I'm not sure how I did it. My memory begins with the crack of the bat and the sight of the ball rising.
exactly the way it happened. But that's the way it should have happened. And that's the way I like to remember it. And if dreams and memories sometimes get confused, well, that's as it should be. Every kid deserves to be a hero. Every kid already is.